G'day, today we're going to have a look at level 20 in Train Valley 2. Uh, this one is the palace. Alright, so we've got 16 and a half minutes. Uh, we have to earn at least 450,000 and we can't use pause. This would probably be the death of me. It is painful. I use it all the time. Okay, the very first thing you can see that I'm starting with the game paused. It doesn't care. Um, that's not failing us automatically on the uh, achievement. Uh, if you're not aware of this setting, in settings there is this tick box that says start level paused. Very handy for this one because you can start your build uh, before the game starts. Alright, so we need four furniture here. We need eight furniture there, so we need 12 furniture in total. We need 12 glass and we need five jewellery. Uh, jewellery requires glass, furniture requires glass, and glass obviously requires glass. So we need eight, four, 12, 24, 29 glass in total. Um, so that's probably our main thing we want to focus on. So let's get a path built down to get our sand production going. And so that this guy's doing something at the start, we'll send him over to get wood going. Okay, um, so another new thing on this level is this is level 20, so we've now graduated to having trains that have four carriages as our starting point. So you don't want to send too many guys too quick on this one, uh, even though they can hold eight. Um, if we were to send a third train here, it would just hit basically a full, um, full reserve. So we'll just send two trains to, to start these ones off. Um, what we would probably want to do next is get uh, onto moving uh, glass. So we will um, start building this path now. Even this is probably a bit premature for him. I might pause him uh, once he's a bit closer. Okay, so let's see how we go. Beautiful. Perfect. Now the next little build we want to do is just this one here. Because uh, then what we can do is we can send trains from our lower uh, station. So the work of this, uh, the workers can come from this one. Um, now, one thing of note in the middle here is you can't have a three-way intersection, so you only have two-way, which means that with this set in the middle, uh, you've got no choice but to sort of just um, have it as this diamond. So we're going to have to use this tunnel down the bottom and build a bridge to to connect this guy to the top half of the of the map. A little bit more expensive, but it works. first sand on its way. Getting the sand going as quick as possible is ideal too because it's worth twice as much as the workers. So uh, that's a much more profitable train we, we're moving now. And what we'll start to look at is connecting to the boards over here. So it's going to cost us 17,000. Now where I'm looking at putting that bridge is definitely up the top here because when you join the bridge here it's got to connect here and here to uh, allow that train to go both ways. And if we're using this side as well, then this one needs a, uh, that sort of three across. And so we can have one, two, three there for one, and one, two, three there for the other. So, um, yeah, we've just got to make sure you put those at the far ends, because otherwise you'll only be able to put one train on one side and the other won't be able to go both ways. Send one more. A lot of guys up there. No harm in just sending tons of guys everywhere. This is one where we need to do it for money, uh, and so we just want to make money um, wherever we can get it. Okay, so let's start connecting this guy up and across there. The only thing that we need boards or wood for is the furniture, so it means we only need 12 in total. So we can also look to try and get that started soon too.
send one lot of guys from here down to make more sand. Uh, once this guy gets made, we'll send him over here to make boards. And then we'll send two lots of these guys just up to be ready for furniture. to our boards here. And we'll send some workers on behind the sand. And some workers behind that lumber. Now that that's arrived, what we'll do is we will get our first load of glass out. Go send that to the furniture. And then following up behind that, we'll start sending out boards. So this here is basically the very last of the boards that we actually need to make. Um, the only reason that we probably will make more is because the wood is so close. That's cheap money that we can make, uh, easy money rather, um, for getting our 450,000. that we're making, we're going to start looking at how we're going to get to the back here. Um, I'm not sure if you can actually get around that corner at the top there, but I think the better way is just with a bridge here. So we'll just connect that guy and then move a straight line down here and connect that guy. Um, Alright, so we'll start moving a little bit more sand and we'll send it end um, and then we'll send some more guys we'll send these guys up and I'll have the boards right behind them and while they're doing that we'll um, have a look at this there we go now it doesn't matter if this isn't a two-way connection because we don't have to send sand anyway um, up there for any purpose and we'll send some glass on behind that guy. Like I said, we're not making these boards for any reason now, but we may as well make the money that it's associated with uh, moving this guy across. We won't just be sending workers to the logs yet though, because we do still need a lot of workers. And we are uh, we are still pretty shorthand on them. So what we'll do is we'll send these workers, and we'll send these guys up to go and just start making us gold. Send these workers. Um, oops, wrong direction. Alright, we'll send these guys to go do our gold then. And we'll send our first set of furniture home. So we'll send this to the further point, which is this one down here. And what we'll start doing is because we need five glass up there, we may as well get rid of our even number for. Or a divisible by 12 number. 
of the, uh, the glass for down here and we'll send, start sending that to we'll send this guy home as well. We'll send these guys some more sand down here. sand. We'll send these guys down to work on the class. While we're waiting we'll send these guys down here as well. Too bad with our money anyway. We only need about a hundred thousand from here. So we'll send these guys uh, around to do some more gold. And we'll send these guys after them to go do uh, the jewelry. Send these guys home to here to finish off that glass requirement. And we'll send these guys around to get our next load of glass. We just want to make sure we don't press pause at any time here because we're so close to the end. I could send that one sand down, but sending all of it at once, we've still got a lot of time left. Um, it would be good to, um, it's good to get the money, basically. So we'll send these guys up to, um, go be our other workers on the rings. Um, since we're not really... I think we need much workers for anything else. We'll start using these workers to just dump them places and um, make a little bit extra money. Though, like I said, I think we're pretty good anyway. We need 60,000 from here. Okay, so we'll send down now last lot of glass. Gonna make some boards. first one anyway because we are getting a bit low on time. I'll speed things up. So what we'll do is we'll send these three uh, over to the uh, furniture. That's going to put us close enough. Okay, what we'll do is we'll upgrade our next train, because uh, he can take five. We'll 
we'll just speed things up till we've got those five going. There we go. And we'll just make sure we've got our path set right for that guy. And take us home. There we go, five stars. Uh, any questions or comments, feel free to check them below. If you had a different strategy for it, I'd love to hear about it too. Um, please like and subscribe, and as always, I'll catch you later. See ya.